guys. We are headed to go pick up a Chevy Tahoe. It's off the on the uh, side of the road somewhere over in like the Sweeney Old Ocean area. It broke down. I'm not sure exactly what's wrong with it. We are here at the Bucky's over on Highway 35 in Angleton getting fuel. We are headed that way. Thanks for watching guys. All right. So we made it over here to the vehicle. Some gloves here. They're supposed to leave the keys in the cup holder under a koozie right here. Cool. First things first, I'm going to snap some of my pictures. Oop, that was the wrong. Snap pictures. I need traffic on this side of the truck. Coming for a minute, so I'm gonna get over here. This is kind of a normal night as a uh, tow truck driver. Nothing too special about this one, just a normal call. The uh, vehicle broke down, so they called us to come pick it up and take it to a local mechanic shop over there. Jackson area. And this call came in. I actually just finished eating my dinner. It's like there's some coolant under the vehicle there, so I'm assuming it probably overheated. Keeps stepping in ant beds over here. like this. I always like using my guardian angel lights. Help keep you all maybe a little bit safer. You're out here on the side of the road. God dang, there are ant beds everywhere out here. Can't really go nowhere. Let's see if I can do this quickly. be able to pull a little bit more cable off. One ant bed here right next to me. Of snugging up my winch cable, make sure my winch is engaged before I put the vehicle into neutral just in case. Let's say we were on unlevel ground, the vehicle would 
could possibly want to roll away. Normally if this was any other time, I would make sure I was on the other side of the truck. But since there's no traffic coming for a while, I'm stay over here. That way, I'm not over there fighting the ants. drained Step back over here fight the ants what I'll probably do is strap this side of the truck real quick right down the street here. Finish strapping down the other side even though traffic's not too terribly bad right now. I could strap it. I'm going to get off the side of the road. All it takes is one person not paying attention no matter how many people are on the road. That one person could be the one that takes you out. Already too many, too many tow operators. People have been killed on the side of the road this year. Let's see on the news, towing groups and stuff is way too common, unfortunately. Up. I'm gonna finish strapping this thing down. That way we got all four of our straps on it. We still got a uh, 30 or so minute ride back to town. on here real quick and we'll be headed back towards the mechanic shop and we'll get this thing unloaded.
We're out here at the mechanic shop. The straps broke down. Drop it off right here. Maybe they can have a straight shot of getting it into the phase to look at it. off of it. Go ahead and lay the bed down. Probably gonna end up pushing the truck forward maybe just a little bit. Yeah, that might clear the fine. That'll work. That'll work. To neutral real quick. out of it just in case it wants to lock on itself. I'm just going to go ahead and pull a little slack off there with the winch instead of free splint. Go ahead and get it unhooked. Taking my pictures, get the bed all rolled up here. Head on back towards the house, try to get some rest. Probably 10.30 or 11 o'clock at this point. Get some rest. We 
wake up tomorrow and do it all over again. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you on the next one. Thanks for watching.